WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of mostly cloudy Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently we've got a mixed bag out there. The mix goes like this. The Dow is basically flat. It's up one point. The s and is off 14. NASDAQ 100 down 136. Russell's up 6. Semi's down 87. Tranny's up 358. That is as mixed as you get. Gold is trading up 6 bucks right now. 1969 is a print. Silver's up 3 pennies at 2486. Light sweet crude is off 33 pennies. Natural gas down 8 cents. The 30 year treasury printed out at 125.31. That's up 14 ticks. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart we begin with the es mini upper left hand side the es mini on the trading session of uh, july 20th formed a roads momentum indicator top you could get the same type of pattern signal today if there's another bearish reversal candle do you need another one no what you need to do though is not close above 4609.25 if price closes above that that pattern gets negated but right now you've got a top in place spot volatilics has been rising we'll take a look at that for you peter we take a look at the spot volatilics during the trader's ed show uh, but it is still below its 50-day exponential moving average that's at 1483 the nq as we speak right now is trading below the bottom of its bearish structured daily profile now the interesting thing here this looks like it changed to shift it a little bit last night uh, between the time that I sent the uh, the uh, newsletter out, uh, the evening newsletter, that is, and uh, and as I take a look at the charts right now. So you and I have discussed how when price closes below the bottom of bullish structured profile, counter trend moves will find resistance at the center of that profile. It's at 15,681. Turns out yesterday's close was 15,673. It got up as high as the 15,736 level, but the counter trend area held. So that's the key level to be watching today, 15,681. To the downside, we generate an A to B equals CD, the downside if price were to close below 15,483.75. US dollar index um, still trading above profiles. No reason for it to not to, con not to continue to move higher. Of course, we'd have to take a look at the yen, the euro, and the uh, pound. If you take a look at gold, Goldilocks. Yesterday, gold pulled back. You don't see it here on this chart, but it did pull back, tested and rejected its green oscillator and change line. That should have been a buy point out there. Price right now has resistance, so it's got a TD9 count top, and price is going to need to close above, I believe it's the 1989.80 level. And there's resistance up at 1995.60. In the case of silver, consolidated with inside its daily profile. Light speed crude should still target the 80.68 area. Natural gas has got a consolidation with inside profiles, as does the 30-year Treasury. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show. But if you're off to start for Wednesday, please have a wonderful one. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care. Have a great day.